Okay guys, this is uh, another room tour of uh, Carnival Dream 6360 by Robin Jan Can Cruz. I couldn't have said it better myself because I couldn't. I messed up a few times. Yeah. Hi, come on in. on the Carnival Dream. It's a square inside room uh, in the, on, six, on the sixth floor in the middle of the ship. Have a look. This is the, the bathroom. You see the room is in a square shape versus the regular size. And uh, here's the bathroom. It's a standard bathroom. The closets here, there's three ample size closets on to the one side of the bed versus in the hallway it normally is in most rooms. So you've got one here, one here, and the one here with the mirror and the shelving, floor to ceiling shelving. So lots of space, lots of space in front of it too. So it's not in, a, like I say, the normal bedrooms, the normal cabins on a ship have a long corridor with your bathroom and your and your closets. This is all in one square shape. The one thing you might be noticing, the only negative we found about this room, can you hear some thumping in the background? We're right above the atrium, the lobby, where they have music at certain times. So you will find very rarely there's a little bit of a thumping noise like that music but only for a short period of the day. It doesn't go on all night, it doesn't go on late in the evening, so we don't find it bothersome. We like the proximity of this room. So here's your area here, a nice big open area. Look at how much space I have here. Lots of room to spin around. Usually in a, an inside cabin, you're very tight on either side of the bed and, and a narrow hallway. So we love this space here. Um, a little bench here, a large area to be able to do uh, editing or just sit and do your makeup if you choose to. Your drawers here with your hair dryer. Your safe is in here. And in here, your fridge. One, day, one downside we found too. It's a little tiny TV. And look how far away you are. Rob's demonstrating if we were laying in bed, how far away the TV would be. Might need binoculars for that. <laughs> but, so the downsides are the noise. Uh, coming from the music, but it happens very rarely in the in the lobby area. Uh, the upsides are the large square space, lots of room to move around, and a nice location. We're right between the uh, midship and the forward uh, elevators and stairs with a, co a, a corridor that doesn't have, it's not the main corridor, it's kind of an inside inside. So there's no other rooms across from us. There's nobody beside us this way. There's nobody across from us. So there's only somebody on this side and behind and we don't hear anyone. So we really, really like it. When it's quiet and dark in here, it's quiet and dark. We love it. So this is once again cabin 6360, 6360 on the Carnival Dream. Once again, thank you for following us following along. Blah, 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 blah. So this is a room tour by Rob and Jan Can Crew brought to you. Okay, I was going to have you do it with me. Come in the picture with me. Hey guys, hey guys, Rob and Jan Kang Cruz here with another room tour. This is cabin 6306, oops, Rob and Jan Kang Cruz here. <laughs> hey, you talk. Is it higher? Okay guys, this is uh, another room tour of uh, Carnival Dream 6360 by Rob and Jan Kang Cruz. I couldn't have said it better myself because I couldn't. I messed up a few times. <laughs> anyway, take care.